Next, we'll take a look at how we can use Ansible Tower to execute things like PowerShell scripts, which is actually very helpful because it means that if we have legacy solutions in our environment that have worked okay, we can always refactor later and we can leverage the built-in Ansible modules to do things like bring those scripts in to, as a part of our workflow. So in the first place, we'll take a look at the system and the temp folder and, because that's where most of the work will be happening. Next, we'll take a look at the job template. So the same things uh, apply over and over again for us around inventories, credentials, and playbooks themselves. We'll take a glance at the playbook and understand that it is calling the WinShell module. And this script is just doing a, a hello world, basically. And we're using redirection here within the module. Now we could control that in a variety of different ways. It's just the way that we're choosing to do it here. And so we'll go ahead and launch this. Shouldn't take very long. We'll limit on just the system that we want to run for this example. And we should find that this is going to happen very quickly because all it's really doing is it's copying a file over and it's running the PowerShell script using that WinShell module. And so it looks like it's already done its work around the copy. And next it's doing the, the running of the script itself. So if we come back over here, we should see the hello world script is now on the temp directory. And if we look at the output, we actually see the hello world on our date and timestamp. So that's just a quick example of how we can use Ansible Tower to run things like PowerShell scripts.